They might look cute and cuddly, but if you run across one of the thousands of minks on the loose in central Pennsylvania, leave it be. The latest on the efforts to wrangle the critters. It's our top story on Newswatch 16 at 6. Good evening, I'm Lisa Washington. And I'm Scott Schaefer. Many of you have come across the countless minks still running around Northumberland County. According to the Pennsylvania Game Commission, minks are one of the Commonwealth's most skilled hunters. Officials say you should keep yourself and your pets safe and away from the agile, fierce fighters. Newswatch 16's Nikki Cries joins us live from Rockefeller Township, where neighbors remain on edge. Nikki. Scott and Lisa, it's hard to find someone in this area who has not had a mink encounter in the last couple of days. Now, there are a lot of chickens and other small animals in this area, which has residents concerned. Kind of stared at us, you know, came right out, looked at us, kind of like wasn't afraid. Shonda Ronk and many of her neighbors in Rockefeller Township have had an interesting few days as they've come face to face with minks. I let my dogs out and they started sniffing and running right away. And when I looked to my right, there was a brown tail on the ground and it was one of the minks that had come across our patio. Thousands of minks are roaming a section of Northumberland County after they were released from a fur farm early Sunday morning. According to state police, someone broke into a mink farm outside Sunbury. They cut holes in the fencing and opened up the cages. Around 7,000 minks escaped. It's a shame they done that. You know, they, they, them people work hard over there and uh, trying to keep them in and, and keep the place going. Jim Fleming is concerned about the minks. He has two dogs, including Bella, who is smaller than the minks. Fleming caught one of the minks with a fishing net. I seen the tail, and then when I come out, it moved. And I said, no, that's a mink, definitely. I knew right away what it was. Traps can be seen throughout the area. The Ronk family caught one, too. They have chickens and rabbits on their property and do not want minks going after them. My daughter, my husband, and I chased it around for about 10 minutes until we got it into a garbage can. And then we took it to the animal hospital. According to the Pennsylvania Game Commission, the minks will range in size from 12 to 20 inches. They will be black, brown, or white in color. Mink are nasty. They're, they look nice when you see them, but you don't ever want to pick one up or, you know, they, they can hurt you or hurt the animals. As far as who broke into the mink farm and opened up the cages, that's under investigation by the Pennsylvania State Police. Nikki Cries, Newswatch 16, live in Northumberland County.